I think we're getting close to the end of chapter one. It feels like it almost. Hi, Upworkers. Before this video starts, I want to thank my patrons that you see right here for helping out with financial support for this channel as well as the production of more content. If you would like to join these lovely patrons, head over to the Patreon link in the description and pledge a couple bucks a month. Yeah, enjoy the video. Hi Upworkers, I'm Jalen Fulf, and welcome back to Deltarune. Last time we were here, Lancer led us to the castle where we got imprisoned. Our girl Susie had to get us out, and now... It's about time. Which direction were we headed? Oh no, we're, we came from this direction. Oh god. I have a feeling. Alright, this lift should take us out of here. Now, it might take a while, so... Get comfy, everyone. Hey, Rousey. You know Lancer's dad, the king? Yes. When we meet him, you think we'll have to... hurt him? Susie? I mean, I could easily smash him, but... You guys, I know it's not really your thing. You're more about, uh, groveling like total losers. And I was thinking, maybe... I could do that too? Susie? You mean you want to try acting? Uh, well... Susie, we'd be happy if you acted with us. And don't worry, we'll be there to help you. You won't have to figure it out by yourself. Sure, alright. Hey, Rousey. Susie? Are you still gonna make those, uh, cakes? Well, will you stop making fun of me? Well, if I have to, I guess. Then I'll bake you as many as you like, alright? <laughs> yeah, like you can make that many, dude. Well, this is our stop. Hey, Chris, wait a sec. You know, I'm starting to realize. It'll be easier for us to get out of here. If we all, uh, get along a little more. So next time we fight an enemy... If you tell me what to do, I'll listen to you. Um, but you know, don't tell me anything stupid. Or I'll go back to smashing heads, alright? Chris, I'm counting on you, okay? Susie joins the party for real. Oh god. This might be it. Yep, first floor. Do we get to go back? Where will you ride the elevator to? Let's go back to prison, because I may... may have missed something. Whoa! Oh, whoa! We are the three former kings. We beg you, free us! Once, all four of us rolled together, but when the night arrived, everything changed. Oh, my diamonds, my jewels, you must tell me if they're all right. Oh. Oh, God. I was arrested for making a puzzle without a license. I, I'll never make another sword search. Promise. All right. Since I didn't want to fight you guys, I got locked up. How can I? You guys seem way nicer than the king. Oh, wow. How about you guys? Us animals used to be alone in these cages. Now everyone's here. So many new people. Wish we could go back to the good old days. When it was just in these filthy cages. Oh dear god! Animal Cracker references. <laughs> fascinating. Very fascinating. I wonder... Which direction is this? 
Well, this is the way to Susie's cell. And that's the dead end. Okay, so Susie managed to get through us. Easy. So now I know what the issue is. All right. Back to floor 1F. Just take care of that for now. And elevator to prison, formerly known as elevator to basement, which just happened to have a lot of cages. Yep, I thought so. Oh god! Let's just take care of it. Rhythm Rangers can be sparking into view. Um, act. Compliment. And defend. You told Suzy to compliment the enemy. Uh, are you serious? What good could I say about someone trying to kill us? Aw, oh, Suzy, if you're stuck, why not try saying something you wish someone would say to you? You are unbanned from Freehand Sandwich Day. No one ever said that to me before. I'm the Diamond Tears the Rough. Aladdin references. Nice. Please keep body tackling the soda machine. Oh dear god! Alright. Okay, so Susie is doing the right thing now. Which direction is this? Oh, this is out of the castle! Pfft. What the hell? Roden's room. Yes, that's a door. Oh. Hi. Hey, it's you. You're that peaceful lightener. Whoa, you even tamed the beast that was tormenting us. Beast? What beast? Oh, you even taught the beast to talk. Here, have a Choco Diamond. Oh, they're referring to Susie. We sold all of our beds to replace them with treasure. My back hurts, but life has never been better. Normal everyday riches acquired from a legitimate source. It's on the wall. Looks like a family photograph. Oh, everyone's a diamond. Fascinating. Just wait for this guy to leave. Okay. And go. Maybe I'll try something else, but let's see this way first. What is this way? That's spikes. We'll have to find another way through that. But until then... Yeah, I'll see about going in this direction first. See what's down here. You opened the treasure chest. Inside was Club's sandwich. Okay, so Club's it is. Alright. Why don't we try something different and go from this direction? See what's over here. Oh. So the worms have decided to crawl out and play. Uh. Who's there? Gah ha 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 ha, fools. I am Roxel's card, thou greatest adversary. Thou may have clawed us past all those other conundrums, but thou were created by utter weaklings. Now prepare thyself for the strongest puzzle of thou's life. Toil, worms. I know what this is. God damn it. Very simple puzzle. 
Very simple puzzle. Nice try, asshole. Anyway. I assume, yep, the stairwell is free for us, and we go this way now. Oh god. We got these guys now. I'll just I'll just fight one of them. Head happy. Blocked the way quietly. You ordered Susie to flirt with the enemy. And hell no. Aw, oh, Susie, it's okay if you don't know how. What? Shut up. That's not the problem. Are you sure? Alright, look, wise guy, I'll show you. Watch this. Ahem. <clears throat> so, uh... Come here. Often? Head happy felt awkward and left. Hey, get back here and let me flirt with you. Oh, dear God. Dear God. Um... You ordered Susie to flirt with the enemy. Hell nah, let's see what let's see Rousey do it. I suppose if it can't be helped... Happy, your beauty is just transcendent. Your hair is like a waterfall of... Wait, um, do you have hair or... Head Happy felt awkward and left. Oh, oh dear, wait. Not so easy, huh? Oh god. Alright. If, if you guys won't do it, I will. You flirted with Head Hathi. It was highly effective. In that case, just spare. Alright, take care of that now, does it? Alright, now hopefully we got a hearts room. Hathi looked at you kindly. Your sins against Hathi were forgiven. Looks like Hathi sold all the gems and replaced them with beds. Looks extremely well slept. Wow! So th th the hearts and diamonds actually did something. Looks like a bed. Will you rest here? No, you won't. It's not your bed. It's like a bed. Will you rest here? No, you won't. It's not your bed. The premise that choices are not... Are, your choices are ignored is high in this one. Oh, God. Go away. Go away. Thank you. Alright, so I'll need another one of these. Okay, so that one is pretty much another one of those, um, puzzles. But where's the end- where's the way we're going? We'll go this way. Yep, I, su I suppose that's the way we're going, but... First, up here. Oh god! Oh god, don't touch me, don't touch me! Okay, I'll have to do the puzzle here. Yeah! Faust guys really think that was all I had? Wrong! It's time for you to feel my real power! Behold, my ultimate puzzle! Have at you! Oh god! I know what this is! Ah! Ah ha 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 ha! Gullible worms. That wasn't really my ultimate puzzle. I have a waste better one right here. Can... can we see it? No. <laughs> oh, God. 
He's gonna try to put us through one more puzzle soon, but but first, get rid of these guys. How about you? Oh, everyone's here! Hathi is the second party member. It's the healer. She was in charge of catering the party. Unfortunately, the cake she commissioned was destroyed in a field somewhere. Oh no, Rousey would have made you a better one! I'm the first party member. I'm in charge of the DPS. Dancing party soundtrack. Oh, and here's... The party, party boy. Oh, let us take your coat and put it in the toilet. Ha, huh, which we don't even have. Please try the baseballs. Yeah, eat so many you choke. Do they eat sports? Then we can all play Twister. Just stay out of our way. We lose even by ourselves. Oh, <laughs> God. It's a giant baseball for parties. It's a boombox. It's playing clubs music. Oh, dear God. Dear God. All right. What else is there? Well, this is it. A bicycle is lovingly tucked into bed. <laughs> Can't really do much about this room. Let's see what's in the shop. Welcome to my shop, you ungrateful worms. Oh, wow. Let's take two more of these. I... For this game, I'm not really in the talkative mood. I'm sure, I'm sure other streamers will have time to talk to people, but I just want to get through this right away. See you down in the dungeon, worms. Alright, so now with that, let me go ahead and equip these. Can we give him another weapon? Yeah, I'll do that. Let me just... No. Um... So we got Guts up for Susie. Rousey doesn't have any effects. Alright. So coolness factor... Up? <laughs> What's over here? Oh, another elevator. Um, ride the elevator? Ride. Is that back to the first floor or something? Elevator to top floor. No longer stuck at the top floor. Oh. Okay. So I presume... That's just to ride down to wherever that is. I assume we're... Alright, now, if anything, our destination is probably going to be here. In the stairwell. Whatever we have to face is going to be up here. So without further ado, let's just go. Oh, wait. 
There. Lancer, show yourself. Enough, worms. Thou may have cheated to through my puzzle my puzzles, but in combat thou shalt be scattered about. Come, knaves, prepareth for battle with Whatever this is. Huh? It's gonna be from earlier. But its crown looks different. Yes, with my control crown. Oh, did I miss something from Susie? <laughs> I may control any disc shaped life form. Oh no! It looks like it's in pain. It looks the same. Yes, the control crown is painful. But I'm certain this creature will feel with relief when it sees how much more pain that'll be in. Let's tempt. Oh, Susie's idea? Susie, you want to act? Oh, what's your idea? Um, well, how do I say this? I kind of need you for this one. That's fine, Susie. I'll help. You want to apologize to it for earlier, right? Nah, I just need you to stay still. Chris, we gotta get that crown off its head. Help me throw Rousey at it. Oh, dear God. The crown loosened a little. Oh, dear God. Um... I'm just gonna bow. You bow to K-Round. It bowed back, its crown loosened a little. Oh! Oh! Let's go ahead and throw again. The crown loosened a little. The crown is 58% loose. Alright, let me break from that for a little bit. And take a Lancer cookie. And, uh... Take a Lancer cookie. And for our girl Susie... Take a Hearts Diamond, or a, no, a Hearts Donut. And defend. All right, so I took care of that now. All right, let's just um, throw again. The crown greatly loosened. Oh my god! The crown is 93% loose. I'm gonna need to do one more act. Bow. Um. Heal up. Chris. And then... Heal prayer to self. You bow to K-Round. It bowed back. Its crown loosened a little. Yay! Why, brilliant. Just brilliant. I knew you could do it, thou great heroes, thou. Thou seeth that was merely a friendly test of thine abilities. But thou hast won, and now nothing blocks thine path. I, personally, could not be less of an obstruction. But you- Luck be with you, heroes! Oh, God! Now we go upstairs again, and... What? Um... Lancer! What did you do? Riches, they shine with avarice. What did you do, Lancer?
Lancer. Hi, Lancer. Hey, there's Lancer. Father? Lancer, my son. Have you dispatched the Lightners as I commanded? No, but, but I did even better. It turns out we don't actually have to fight them. They said they could just talk to you and they're alive. Yes, and I think you'll like them a lot. There's Susie, she's very purple and strong, and... Where are they now? Um... Hey! It's nice to meet you. Lancer. Lancer, my son. Yes, father? Do you remember what I told you? D don't get too attached. You have failed. They have poisoned you with your sentimentality. Free yourself, Lancer. They care not for you. Their only goal is to destroy our glorious fountain. They are scum. Oh! What an insult! No, they aren't. What did you say? Oh, God, the look on Rousey and Susie's faces. Let him go! Ha, 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 ha. You want me to let him go? Then how about this? I'll drop him off the edge and let him splatter. Unless you all kneel and learn your place. What will it be, Lightners? Don't listen to him, Susie! He'll... He'll... Now watch, Lancer. See what happens when you befriend Lightners. What the? You, you traitor! Come back here! Alright, enough already. Who the hell do you think you are? <laughs> to my people, I am a hero. To you? I'm the bad guy. Oh god. He looks like a more mature version of Lancer, except with a, um, um, let's talk by Susie first. Susie tried to reason with the king. Alright, listen up. Lancer's my friend, so if we can get by without hurting you, then if I perish, so be it. Show my son the monster you really are. Alright, you want to see what I can do, huh? Susie's will is changing. Talk became Red Buster. How dare you come here, Lightners? Alright, let's try with Rousey. Rousey tried to reason with the king. You might not realize it, but this is a world where you don't have to fight. I know if we try, we can all find another way. Such simple-minded platitudes. A shame you will not live to realize your naivety. Now, perish with the pathetic lightners you worship. Sorry, my friends and I aren't going anywhere. Rousey's will is changing. Talk became dual heal. You that left us in the shadows, stripped of meaning. Oh, dear God. Okay, that was funny enough. Alright, um... Why don't we talk with them? You tried to reason with the king. Silence, Lightbringer! Your very existence goes against our own. By the knight's will, I shall shatter your heart to pieces. Your will is changing. Talk became courage. You dare return to torment us once again? Oh god, this is very hard. Alright, let's try... Courage. You encourage the party. The party's defense raised for this turn. Be gone! We have found fresh purpose! Battlefield is rumbling, oh god. Um, dual heal. 
Your soul shined its power on Rousey. Rousey cast Dual Heal. For the night has appeared. Alright, let's dual heal again. Your soul shined its power on Rousey. Rousey cast dual heal. The night that pulls the fountains from the earth. Okay, so that did everything that we wanted to. Uh, courage. You encouraged the party. The party's defense raised for this turn. Holy fountains, whose shadows are creating a new world? Our world. Let's just keep doing courage, see if it ha does anything. You encouraged the party. The party's defense raised for this turn. Do you see you're now our new purpose? Just take a defense boost every single time already, alright? Soon this world shall be blanketed in darkness, and darkness shall rule it. Alright, dual heal it is. Then you may see what it is like to live in despair! Oh god. Um. Can we just do another dual heal, please? Soul shine its power on Rousey. Rousey cast dual heal. Now enough talk! Fall before the chain of justice! Oh dear god. Let's just do courage again. You encourage the party. The party's defense raised for this turn. You're quite strong, aren't you? Alright. So now I gotta dual heal again. Your soul shined its power. There we go. If I keep fighting you like this, then... Just keep defending. It seems that... Keep courage! My knight, I shall not fail you. Enough is enough. I see. I see that I cannot defeat you. I have grown exhausted from our long battle. Lightners, I... Perhaps I... I have been too cruel. The truth is, I was not always this way. There once was a time... where Darkners and Lightners lived in harmony. A time where Darkners could fulfill their purpose in peace. It would be a lie to say that I, too, do not yearn for those days. Perhaps, perhaps you young ones are right. Please, let us put away our weapons. There must be a peaceful solution to all this. Come now, Susie. 
I'm glad you're starting to realize, Mr. King. None of us really want to fight. If you can just tell us about your worries, I'm sure we can all be friends, Mr. King. Yes, friends. That sounds lovely. <coughs> My apologies, I am... I am not used to fighting like that. My body is getting weak. Oh, don't say another word. There, you should be all healed up. How do you feel? L let's see. Never better. You! Did I say you could get up? Chris! Oh, spare me the heroics. You, you're the leader, aren't you? So what's your plan? To laugh as you cast us all back into obscurity? You can't even say. Young one, let me tell you a secret. Quiet, quiet people. Piss me off. Oh my god! Hey, get away from my friend. <laughs> or what? You'll kill me? Nah. So what's your plan then? To talk me to death? You stupid, stupid lightner. You honestly think you have any way to convince me not to kill you? Nah. But they might. Lancer? Everyone? What is the meaning of this? Sorry, Dad. You're being overthrown. When I told everyone you were fighting the Lightners, everyone remembered how kind they were. They decided they'd rather have a king that accepts them. Me? Now I'm the Dad. You idiots! The Lightners are your enemies! Fools! I'll kill you! I'll kill all of you! Yikes. I think someone needs a timeout. Go to your room, Dad. No! <laughs> you all right, Chris? Chris, Susie? Oh, you're all right. Yeah, it'll take more than that to take us down. Chris, Susie, I'm I'm sorry. Because I healed the king, we almost we almost Susie, you were right. I I was foolish to think we could act so soft to everyone. This isn't a world where kindness always wins, is it? Eh, it's complicated. Yeah, sometimes there's people you just gotta fight. But if you never let your guard down, then... You might just hurt someone you care about. Aw, oh, Susie. You're beginning to sound like a real hero. Eh, don't get used to it. Then I... I suppose you and Chris should return home now. Yeah, I... I guess that's right, huh? Well, uh, see ya. Is it really the way home, though? Hey, Chris. Wait a second. Um, I... Look, I know you want to give a real goodbye to everyone, right? I mean, I'm all for leaving right away, but... You know, we could go back a sec if you wanted. Uh... Yeah. Well, then what are we waiting for? Let's head back. Chris? Susie? You came back? Um, well... Chris just wanted to say bye, you know? Oh, actually... Everyone here wanted to say goodbye, too. Please, let me know when you leave, alright? Yeah, yeah, we'll try not to skip you. In that regard... Way to go, kids. Now we can go back to making the puzzles we love. Life's got no tutorial, so try your best. Best. You're the best. Oh, God. Honestly, we owe you. Oh, yay. You're absolutely amazing. Great work. 
Thank you, I can go back to being a coat hanger now. By the by, I asked Seam to come here, but there wasn't any interest. Oh god. Even a little ball can say something like thank you. What now? Darn, horsey, you, you even done us a big help. Now all of us pieces can live in pieces. You did it. You ousted that rotten tyrant. I'll happily accept a bounty of credit for my contributions. Unless the king reappears, in which case, I did nothing. Wonderful work, mine amigos. Thou hast toppled the tyrant, freed star creatst. Truly, if history shall not forget the tale of Roxel's card and the three heroes. Three heroes including us. I knew you could do it. Though I was your enemy, I was cheering for you. That's how much I disliked my job. What now? The future looks sweet, like a pile of bees puke, which is honey, I think. A kingdom with so much hope. Hope you didn't screw it up. That means thank you. Come to our next birthday, too. We'll have one soon, if that's possible. Hathi looked at you proudly. Kiss. Ah. What's going on? I slept through everything. <laughs> very well. Very well. Oh my god! What ho? What about us? Aren't we going to be restored as kings? Ah, my treasure is unharmed. Carry on, then. Us animals decided it's okay if the kings stay in the cages as well. But they'll have to put on animal ears and noses. Oh, good grief. I'll be honest. At first, we weren't sure who make our new king. I mean, Lancer has always been a bit of a pain. But after seeing how nice he treats you guys, I think he'll be fine. So Lancer, Mama Miba, what a celebration. This calls for a cake. And this time, I'll make it out of metal so animals can't eat it. We're animals too, you know. Susie, blue person whose name I neglected to learn all along. I thought you were going home ways. We were, but Chris wanted to say bye, you know. Oh, really? Oh, that's funny. I thought you wanted to say bye because we're friends. Huh? I mean, I did not want to. Um, so you're the king now, huh? Yes, and I'm changing some big rules. First, lightners are now legal. Second, prison is now only for dads. Sounds like some pretty good changes. <laughs> hey, your dad was uh, protecting the fountain, right? Is it going to be okay if we mess with it? I have no idea. But it's you guys, so I trust you. If something bad happens, we'll fix it out. Yeah, guess we'll just see it, guess. Well, see you later. Come back soon! There's always around town for a couple of clowns. Because you rescued it, it grew to respect you. Well, actually, maybe it shrunk to respect you. Wait. Can I not go further? That's it. Oh my god! So that's everyone! What happened to, um... What happened to that red guy? Susie, Chris, are you going to leave? Um, I... I just wanted to say I... I... I really enjoyed meeting you too, and... Hey, can you stop mumbling into your hat for a sec? Can barely hear you, dude. Uh oh, I'm sorry. Um, Chris, Susie, I. I hope I can see you again soon. Next time I'll make you lots of yummy cakes, alright? Um, yeah, sure, dude. <laughs> Let's go, Chris. I assume that Susie's probably going to say the exact same thing. Nope. That's it. Oh. Is this the fountain? Don't know how, but it feels like we stumbled into something really important, didn't we? Well, there's no time to think about that now. Right now, it's time to go home. Right, Chris? And we're going through. As you stood in front of the fountain, you felt something strange. It was as if 
Your very soul was glowing. What? What happened? I can't see anything. Hey, watch it! Huh? The unused classroom. How'd we get here? Hey, Chris. What? What just happened? Like, that wasn't a dream or anything, was it? Anyway, as I was saying, let's just tell Alphys we couldn't find any chalk. Man, the sun's already setting. Everyone else must have gone home by now. Guess Alphys will know better than to ask us next time, huh? Well, guess we should go. See you later, I guess. Chris? Let's go back there tomorrow, all right? Oh my god. The door is locked. Okay, so apparently there's a lot more than just that. Now I assume Toriel's... Mrs. T Miss Toriel is written in cursive on the dry erase board. Seems like it hasn't been erased in a very long time. Oh god. Some kind of primitive sculpture. Who knows what it represents? What else we got? The Throne of the Gods. Kids books. Some of them used to be yours. Oh! My. My. Now I assume... Oh, everyone went home. Huh. Chris? Whatever have you been doing? I sat in the car waiting for you after school for half an hour. I called and called, but you never picked up. You had your poor mother worried sick. Chris, I am afraid I am going to have to punish you. Huh? A friend? You were spending time with a friend? Chris, I will make an exception this time. You can continue your adventures a little longer. But when you return home, you are going to have to go to bed early. See you soon, honey. Aw, what a, what a proud mother she is. So I guess I'll just walk home myself then. Let's stop here for a little bit. Chris, you survived Susie. I was getting worried. Now you can finally pay off your family debt. How to Draw Dragons is 2,583 days overdue. However, Chris, I'm a benevolent volunteer assistant. If you turn it in this week, I'll reduce your fine to a mere 64.23. Consider it, Chris. Chris, what's up? Caddy's working, so I'm starting on our project. I've already copied a bunch of pictures. It's the same picture of a soccer ball 73 times. Dear God. Gotta go to colleague. So Tim Stubby, hard. She's reading a comic full of hot demon guys. <laughs> oh dear god. I love reading books, especially the books upstairs. You should really read them. Upstairs. And uh, you can't let me go through. You looked through the window to the computer lab. There seems to be a dog inside working at a computer. Seems like it's making a g g game. Seems like you shouldn't interrupt it. Seems like when the game's finished, you can go in. You just have to trust the dog. Aw, poor little guy. Hi, Undyne. Hey, punk! Get out of the road! You're blocking traffic! Oh, wait. It's just Asgore's kid. Sorry, I'm a little, uh, worked up lately. This job is so boring. Nothing ever happens in this town. Eh, I just wish something would shake things up. Huh? You got something to report? Uh, Alphys. Alphys? Who's Alphys? No idea who you're talking about. Why? Did they do something illegal? Gotcha! 
By seeing all of us, I'll tackle them. <laughs> They're as good as dead. Help you? Aw, uh, you wanna help me? Sure, punk. Get someone to rob a bank so I can suplex them. Wait, do we even have a bank? Hey, get someone to build a bank! <laughs> Alright, Dark World. What? There's a Dark World inside the school? Uh, sure, kid. There's no law against Dark Worlds anyway. That's a job for the school board. <laughs> God. Oh, it's you. Are you here to play the piano again? The patients can't hear it well from here, but I personally enjoy it. It's an obligatory hospital piano shrunk to fit in the corner. As a result, it's missing most of the good keys. Play it. Plank. <laughs> it's one of those sliding beat toys that naturally spawns inside doctor's offices. The beats march, march grimly along this set path. So there's a lot more. You knocked on the door to the police station. Someone's coming up to the window. They just closed the blinds. Seems like the police aren't really feeling it right now. Oh, dear God. Oh! Police tape is blocking the way. The tape simply reads, Nyah! I'm dying. You silly, silly little fishy fish. The mayor's charisma is about zero. No, it's negative. But she works hard and has a good track record, so she runs unopposed. That's politics. Rarely. <laughs> the politics bear from Undertale. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The mayor is busy right now. If you need to see her, please try causing some terrible crisis. Hey, short stuff. Why would you possibly need to talk to the mayor? Your allowance too low? Ate too much candies? Lost your frisbee in the wash? Hey, short stuff. That's what the cops are for. Hey. Good thinking. Good thinking. Hi. Chris, what a pleasant surprise to see you here, and on a school day. There must be a reason that you came here at such a time. I, Father Alvin, implore you. If you have anything weighing on your mind, please speak. Fruit juice. Chris, if you want some of our sick fruit juice, you should come to our service. Our choir sounds a bit thinner since your brother went away. Chris, it would be wonderful if you would sing with us, or even participate to any extent, instead of just trying to drink the fruit juice. Oh. Okay. There's something down here. It's locked. Oh my god. Someone please give me an idea of what what's going on over there, specifically? What else do we got? Oh, cemetery. What do we got? Shira, a karaoke, mich karaoke microphone for a brave singer. Modeler, a big bone for the leader of the pack. Crystal, a snowy gemstone for a proud mother. Gerson, renowned historian, author, and teacher. Poor Gerson. Anyway, let's carry onward. Hey, look who's walking around! How are you, kid? Who the hell are you? Are great to see you again. Yeah, it's real nice, isn't it? Especially considering I've never met you before. The name's Sans. Sans the Skeleton. I'm new in town. What's up? What about the store? Behind me? Yeah, that's the grocery store. Unfortunately, it's closed. What a pain. I really wanted to buy some milk. Someone ought to complain to the guy who runs it. We just moved here, so I hardly know anyone. Why? Got anyone I should know better? Uh... My mom. Your mother, huh? Too late. I already befriended your mom last night! She's great. Came to the store to buy chocolate kisses. Said she's gotta lock her door to stop you from meeting him. You sound like a fun kid, huh? My teacher. Elphus? Yeah, I know about her. Came into the store with a suitcase and sunglasses. Thought she was part of the mob. She opened the case and stuffed it full of instant noodles. 
paid in small bills, then slunk out of the place, pajamas trailing on the floor. Anyway, our relationship is uh, purely business. So uh, I guess I'll just let her do her thing. What else you got? Whoa there, tiger. You can't just jump straight into friendship. It takes time. All right, that's enough time. Take this. Call it whenever you feel like. You got Sansa's number. Harsh, but fair. <laughs> hey, bud. Are you busy tomorrow? I need some help with something. It'd be great if you could come over. I live just next door, you know? Uh, yeah. Whoa, you were deliberating for a while. Gee, what's wrong? Don't want to hang out with a stranger? Well, guess I should can complain. Huh? What are we going to be doing? Oh, I'm not going to be there. That'd be weird. It's just going to be you and my little brother. He needs friends. Thanks for hanging out with him. See ya. Put Pyrus. Knock, knock, knock. No response, but the distant trousel of bones. That's Papyrus, all right. Knock, knock, knock. Ooh, are you the human that lives at the top of town? Wow, my mommy told me about you. Does it hurt to be made of blood? Oh, wow. Knock, knock, knock. Huh, that sounds like the knockoff beginner. Come back when you've gotten better at knocking. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, hey. Yo, Chris, you survived Susie, huh? I mean, I never saw her beat anyone up, but uh, I'd be careful. Like, one time me, Snowy, and Jockington were playing handball, and she just kept creepily watching us from the corner. Then when the ball rolled over to her, she just, uh, froze solid. And kicked the ball as hard as she could, right into Officer Undyne's car. Then Undyne came out, smiling, cracked her knuckles, and totally wiped us at handball. Anyway, Susie sucks, Chris. <laughs> That's what we got here. Oh, you're lucky, Chris. You got to miss class with Alphys. It's not fair, huh? If I skipped class, my dad never let me hear the end of it. <laughs> That's actually not even remotely funny. Knock, knock, knock. Oi, Snowy! What did I tell you about knocking the door so hard? Don't do it! It's really gonna hurt your face. We don't have arms, you know. Um. Oh, hi. Uh, hi. Oh, Chris! Chris, you're okay! I, I was really worried when you didn't come back. Where'd you go? Did you skip class? Well, don't worry about it. I'm the cool teacher, you know. You're not in trouble. Well, let me know if you need anything. It's a dirty trash can. Another dirty trash can. It's a trash can full of well-kept flowers. It's a saucer of milk. Oh, oh, Chris. D did you want to talk about something? Chalk. Chris, even though you never got the chalk... You deserve an award for trying so hard to find it. So in return, I can let you borrow, um... My homemade DVD collection of The Simptons! You know, the sitcom about the middle-class monster family? It's got every episode in all 28 seasons. It's the funniest, most quotable show ever. But make sure you don't watch past the second season since they just rebooted as Simpsons Turbo. They all started driving their own motor vehicles and fighting giant academies and stuff. The main problem about that is it kind of lost the focus on family that I had earlier when their vehicles were shaped like animals and they were friends with the animal vehicles. And let's not get into Simpsons gals... When the gravitational field just... Huh? You don't want to watch it? That's okay, Chris. Okay, so... I believe we are going this direction again. And to the diner. You're alive. Nice. I'm working. Uh, we'll take the special, and do you have any edible glitter? The youngest one won't eat anything if it doesn't look like treasure. Oh, wow. So, for you two girls, that'll be the crepes and a cinnamon latte. Two bunny parfaits and a piece of firewood? I like the vibe of the waitresses here. Maybe I should sign up, too. Nah, serving drinks wouldn't really suit a fire elemental. If I got nervous, I'd just melt all the ice. Looking at my rugged body, you must wonder what kind of secrets I hold. My secret is, I put all my leftover pancakes in this giant hat. <laughs> what a way to fit them all. Ice Wolf does not like ice and drink. Ice Wolf likes ice. To be drink. Or to be drink. <laughs> hey there, haven't seen you in a while, huh? I remember, back on Sundays after service. 
You and your family would come on and order the special. Of course, things happened, and then... Y'all stopped coming together. But every Sunday, you and your brother'd still come in. He'd order you a hot chocolate. And you two'd sit down at that table in the corner. Drawing shapes in the window with your breath. You must really miss him, huh? Here, how about this? Chris got the hot chocolate. On the house, hun. Oh, that's so sweet of you. Ice me up! Ice me up, boss! Would you be interested in trying some of our mini 24 pizza flavors? We've got normal, cheese, ice, gravy, double ice, pepperonis, and more. Stop on down at Icy's Pizza. <laughs> oh god, someone's actually here. Uh, Icy's Pizza, your number one spot for a piping hot piece of pizza. Hey, hey, wait a second. I recognize you. Little buddy, it's me! Wanna chat for a minute before I lose my mind? Uh, no. It's fine, little buddy. You don't have to watch me suffer. Just enjoy your freedom while it lasts. Oh, so he's given up now? The entrance is locked. No one's inside. Seems like all the employees are outside in costume. Oh, dear God. So now what? Hey, neighbor baber, when's your brother Doug gonna come by, huh? -huh? My girls love to see him, he's a sweet little man. He's just got one problem, he doesn't like my wife's cooking. What's wrong, Douglas? You don't like frozen cat food, huh? -huh. Little Chrissy, like, what's up? Give Aunt Caddy a hug. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Ha ha ha, I'm not even actually your aunt. Oh my god, can I talk to you about something? Actually, like anything though, your choice. Uh, no. Oh, you gotta go? Do you have, like, homework? You should, like, let me help. Haha, <laughs> JK, I totally don't want to. Laters. Aw, oh, Chris, like, if you want to come in, our cat flap is, like, always open to you. Cat flap? Whereabouts? Chrissy, like, long time no see. What's up? Did you want to talk about something? No. Aw, oh, Chrissy, you just wanted to say hi? That's adorable. Now get out of here. Oh, wow. Knock, knock, knock. Ah, I'm afraid no one's home right now, darling. Now, why don't you prance on home? Oh, guess who it is? Dum-dee-dum. -dum. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. Here we are. Howdy, how can I... Oh, Chris! Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot if you don't like hugs like that. Well now, make yourself at home, Chris. You can help yourself to anything you like. Anything? Even these seeds? No? It's a cash register. There's not much change inside. It's a flower. It's some kind of catalog. There's a car magazine underneath. Oh god. <laughs> What's up here? Oh. Okay. Yes, these flowers are still kicking. Quite hard to take care of them in this climate. It's a small TV on top of some superhero comics. It's a rusty fridge with some photos on it. Oh, Chris! If you're hungry, help yourself to anything you want. Uh, don't. You decide not to look. There's some dirty fur stuck in the drain. That's... Asgore. And with that, I shall be on my way. Oh, Chris, before you go... Here, for your mother, our secret. You got the bouquet of flowers. Have a great day, Chris. Is there more to this? Oh my god, there's more to this. Nothing better than hanging at the lake with my best bro. Watching the waves go by. True. Eh. 
We'll figure something out there. But now, I think best way to go is... Uh, which way is... Which way is... It's an ornate gate. It appears to be locked. I guess the best way out is... Home. Here we are. It's your mom's van. Welcome home, honey. Did you have fun with your friend today? By the way, I just finished baking a pie. If you go to bed, it will be cool when you wake. But do not eat it all this time, alright? Chris, what is it, honey? Flowers. Oh, Chris! Flowers? For your mother? How sweet. These are from him, are they not? Er, uh, well, worry not, Chris. I will find some place for them. Uh, never mind. Perhaps just go to bed early tonight. You do not look quite yourself. Oh, do I? It's a butterscotch cinnamon pie. It's still cooling. It's a trash can. Somehow it's emitting a pleasant floral scent. Oh! Okay. Good night, mother. The door is locked. Oh, it's, so it's definitely this room I see. It's a red wagon with a rusty birdcage in it. Looks like it's seen quite a few crashes. It's a computer desk. There are many boxes under it filled with old books. There are CDs under the bed. Classical, jazz, religious, ska. There's also a game console. It has one normal... Alright. If you go to bed, this chapter of your adventures will end. Will you go to bed? I believe yes. You decided to go to bed. What? What the? What the? What? What? The heck? To be continued in chapter two. Well, that is it for for Delta Rune chapter one. I loved playing chapter one, and it crashed. <laughs> oh well, that's it. So yeah, let me know if you want to play chap. Let me know if you want me. Ugh. So that's it for Delta Rune chapter one. Let me know if you want to play chapter two. This was amazing, Toby Fox. This was very incredible. I don't understand why you would put... 
and my dog is going nuts with her toy. Besides, I cannot describe in words how amazing this is. How amazing this game has been for Undertale. How amazing it has become in when it carried over to Deltarune. I'm surprised that there's so many ins and outs when it comes to the storyline of Undertale. But if this is a different storyline, then I'm proud that you did this. A different timeline, a different universe. Oh well. We'll have to find out when the rest of the game's out. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked what you saw, leave a like, post your comments, hit subscribe with that notification bell, share this video with your friends, and as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until next time.